get your dream interpreted. You can do this live on the radio. 877-591-9696. All right, so it's the morning mess here. Hi, it's Anish. Hey, it's Gina. And it's Carla. So we are on now with Pandora. You are a professional psychic medium. Is that right? I am a psychic medium and sound healer, pet psychic, lots of different things. Yeah, so you're very connected to the spiritual world. And we brought you on today to help with some dream interpretations. I mean, specifically for myself, I had this insane dream. I've never had a dream like it, and I'm just curious if you have some insight for me on what it meant. Oh, of course. Yeah, tell me about it. What happened in the dream? Okay, so in this dream, I was at a hospital with my baby sister, and she was in labor, and my whole family was there, and at some point during labor, another sister of mine had fainted. So my entire family, except for me, they rushed over to my fainted sister, Mm -hmm. and I stayed with my sister in labor. So a few moments later, my sister gives birth to a lizard (laughs) and it was just this tiny little lizard. And then I noticed that my baby sister was really hurt and upset that my entire family was tending to the fainted sister instead. So I scoop up my sister who had just given birth. And when I pick her up, she shrinks to the size of a toddler. So I can like carry her, you know? Yeah. And I have her draped over my shoulder and I'm running out of the room and I look back at my husband who was with me and I say, don't lose that lizard because we love it. <laughs> and I run over to my family and I'm so upset with them. And I'm like, what is wrong with you? Like, she just gave birth. Why are we worried about, she fainted, she'll be fine. And then I woke up. Okay. Well, so I'm going to, give you exactly what um, I'm seeing about it psychically. So number one, um, your connection with your family is exceptionally important for you. And it is showing me that in this situation and in your life, you feel a responsibility to keep them all happy and safe. Um, That little lizard that was born is actually the birth of a new idea or birth of a new business idea for that sister. Oh, Oh. I got to check in with baby sis. Yeah, so it's an abundant stream um, related to her since she's the one in the dream who had the lizard. But you're protecting her during this process because you feel like you need to give her all the good advice and everything. I actually feel like this is something that's going to pop up within the next 18 months um, and that it's actually going to bring her a lot of joy. Oh, that makes me happy to hear. By the way, it's the morning mess. We've got Pandora, our dream interpreter, on the line. Now, Gina, does this make sense so far with what Pandora has said as far as, like, your sister? Is this like, whoa? I mean, I'll be honest. Like, me and my sister, we live in different states, and I don't keep up with her probably as much as I'd like to. So Mm -hmm. I'm not aware of any plans of hers. It sounds like all great news, but I know that there was this whole point in the dream where I went to confront my family, and I was so angry that they weren't giving her the time of day. And I'm wondering if there's anything regarding that um so i feel that part of it goes back to um your sense of fairness and your sense of right and wrong that you have came into this world with um so fighting for equality um fighting for equal treatment even within the family from the time that you were a child um that is just continuing through. So your your anger and frustration is that everybody was not receiving equal treatment, equal energy. Okay. No, that definitely does resonate. I was I was um I make jokes and say I was an annoying little kid, but I was always so angry if I was at school and I saw someone being picked on, I would literally go after the people that were picking on them and then try to make them feel bad because I was mad. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> and I just want to touch on the the sister who passed out. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, what does that mean? That's the one who's getting married. Oh. Yeah. So because she is um, passed out in the dream, it is um, representational of her being checked out, unaware, focused on other things in a big way right now in her world, that she's not even paying attention to the clues that other people may be needing her. I feel like that's the next four months. To, to clear that out, and then she's oh. going to be back in a community or collaboration with the family. That's wild. She's getting married in like a month. So, yeah, she's been quite busy. 
There you go. Yeah. <laughs> okay, well, Pandora, thank you so much for helping out with Gina's dream because it was a wild one. Mm-hmm. And now we wanted your help to uh, interpret our listener's dream, 877-591-9696. We're going to be talking to one of our faithfuls who's been having the same dream for over 30 years, and we're hoping to get that dream interpreted. So... Hang out with us. We're going to get that dream interpretation and maybe yours up next at The Morning Mess on B96.